Hi, this is Dr. Raghu. At times, we do hear that a child has a hole in the heart. Holes in the heart are common ailments which happen in about one per every hundred live births. Many a time, these holes in the heart are small and they get closed on their own. But at times, when they are large, they can lead to lot of complications like elevation of blood pressure in the lungs or heart failure. Today, we are going to understand which type of holes in the heart need emergency treatment or early treatment, which types of defects in the heart can wait for certain time before proceeding for surgery. There are three different types of holes in the heart and as you can see in this heart model, when you open it up, you have got an upper chamber of the heart and a lower chamber of the heart. The upper chamber of the heart is called atrium. The lower chamber of the heart is called ventricle. In between the both the atria, the right atrium and the left atrium, as well as in the right ventricle and the left ventricle, there is a wall which separates. Wall is like a is a, like a partition which separates both the right and the left sides of the heart. This wall is called septum. The wall between the atria or the upper chambers is called the atrial septum and the, the wall or the separation between the ventricles is called the ventricular septum. So the hole between the upper two chambers is called the atrial septal defect. That means a defect in the atrial septum. So also a defect in the ventricular septum is called ventricular septal defect. There is an abbreviation for the atrial septal defect that is what we call as the ASD and the abbreviation for the ventricular septal defect is VSD. In addition, between the arteries which supply the lungs, the blue one supplies the lung and the red one supplies the whole of the body that is called the aorta. Between the pulmonary artery, the blue one and the red one, the aorta, there could be a persistent communication that is called patent ductus arteriosus. So this is also another hole which can be there in the heart. So these three different holes present at different age groups. People with atrial septal defect, even though it is large, they can present very late. Usually at the age of 25 to 35 years of age, the atrial septal defect is detected unless it is so large. Ventricular septal defect or the hole between both the lower chambers is a very small one and this can get closed off its, on its own in more than 70 to 80 percent of times and usually it closes off before eight years. But in case if the whole ventricular septal defect or VSD is very large, it is advisable to perform surgery within one year of age also. So also PDA, the connection between the both the major arteries usually closes off on its own in the first few weeks but if it is persistent we need to close off within the first one year if it is large. So in conclusion ASD we can wait for surgery and if it is detected during childhood we should perform surgery at the age of five years. Ventricular septal defect or VSD if it is large we need to perform surgery as soon as possible and if it is small we can wait up till to the eight years of age so that it might get closed off on its own. PDA, if it is persistent and large, it is once again preferred to do the surgery as soon as possible. In addition, we need to understand how these defects can present. These defects can present as severe breathlessness in the child, especially while the child is getting fed with milk. Sometimes there can be excessive sweating on the scalp or sometimes there can be extensive retraction of the muscles between the ribs. So, and the child growth or the weight gain of the child is below par compared to its peers. So, with all these findings, we can find out whether the child has got a hole in the heart or not. If it is a large hole, I suggest we should get it done early. 
and i am sure there are certain non surgical ways like putting an umbrella device for closing of these defects but it will be suitable in a certain percentage of patients so whenever you suspect a hole in the heart please contact your nearest cardiologist who has got a experience in treating these pediatric cases and i am sure nowadays majority majority means 99.5% of them can be treated safely by surgery or by an umbrella device thank you